when, when I have a relationship with a patient for years, there are moments where you can step up and help them as they, as they need it throughout their life. I'm Dr. Stephen Cox, and I'm a family physician at Wellstar. As a primary care physician, I'm often the first person that a patient will discuss their stress with. During these past few months, everyone has been experiencing increased stress. I like to tell my patients, stress is everybody's problem, meaning that it's going to affect your life, but it's also affecting everyone around you. Elevated stress is causing us to have more strained relationships with our family, and we need to figure out ways to combat that. One way to approach stress management is to identify what you can control and what you can't control. Things you can control are your diet, your exercise, and your sleep patterns. You can try to have less caffeine, and you can try and have less alcohol, all of which can have a major impact on our personality and the way we manage stress. Other ways of managing your stress would include yoga, tai chi, and mindfulness. Uh, you can find out more about these relaxation techniques using free internet resources. And then you also need to tell yourself that things change and whatever difficult moment you're going through now may very well change for the better in the future. Then nothing will stay the same and we can find a lot of comfort in that.